on the Wi-Fi. Hi, Pete. Hello, everyone. I'm about to film a YouTube video for you guys. Um, I'm actually really excited. I'm trying to figure out what I'm going to eat for dinner. I'm so glad to be off of vacation. I'm just ready to get this book and over with so I could just... <sighs> Me and Loyal, we going on the trip. And I can't wait. Um, so it's blurry. I don't wait, let me see. I just take the filter off. Okay. Is it still blurry though without the filter? The filter just add that razzle dazzle. Is it blurry still? Hi Liv. So is is it still blurry? Yeah, I don't know what's wrong. It's clear now. Okay, so yeah, um, it's just like, I hate the constant back and forth. Like, I hate it. I'm annoyed. Like, that shit is annoying. All this shit we still talking about, it happened so long ago. Like, I thought we was over it. I thought everybody was just over it. But, like, no. I'm not about to sit here and let people think that I have a fucking STD or a fucking disease, which I don't have. When that shit happened and it came about on the fucking internet that I had that, instantly I went and got tested. You can't just get, they don't just test you for herpes. You have to walk in and say, I want to get tested. My doctor's like, why? You never, like, what's wrong with you? Like, why, why do you want to get tested? I had to sue my doctor's office, too, because everybody just was in the wrong. Um, once I got tested, I, hold on, wait, I'm about to show y'all because I just went on fucking lab court and, and pulled up my fucking results. But, like, I don't want y'all to think I had fucking herpes. Like, non-reactive, HSV, um fucking negative like don't play with me i really be chill on this fucking internet shit but when it comes to people playing with my health and my fucking vagina that's when i have to like chime in because like nah i let y'all talk about my relationship i let y'all talk about my everything my family everything and i never fucking address shit and it's just like nah we not about to play these type of games like fuck no y'all bitches got me fucked up i really be chill as fuck on this internet shit I don't be going back and forth, but when it comes to my health, no. Like, fuck no. I don't give a fuck. I'm not, I'm not playing that type of shit. Like, no. No, I had to get tested because there was so many people on my lives and on my fucking, in my comments telling me I had a, a disease I never even had. But the reason all of this came about was because Oh, child. Mm. I don't even want to spill all the tea because it's going to get real motherfucking messy the minute I start talking for real. But it's just like, I ain't got herpes, y'all. I'm, I'm in a whole, I have a whole case against a company right now. People done got, three people done got fired from their jobs. Like, it's just annoying. It's, it's just, I can't, I can't get over the fact that people are so negative on social media and they want to believe everything that they see. And it's just like, the fact that a, people would do anything to try to make a person look bad, like that shit is just weak. I don't give a fuck how hard life get. I'm not going to get on the internet and try to bash a bitch. Like, no. If anything, I'm trying to help you. Like, get get on your shit. Like, and that's just that. I don't have time for, no. But what I'm not going to do is let somebody get on. Three years later, we still talking about this. Like, no. Oh, I'm not going to cry. <laughs> fuck no. I'm definitely not going to cry, but it's just like the internet is such a toxic place. And I never, I never address shit. Like I never get on here and tell my side. I never, I just let y'all have it. Like period. Cause it's just.
at the end of the day, we all grown. We all going through our problems. But when it comes to my fucking health, I be letting y'all slide. But I'm not about to just let y'all put that shit on me that I got a fucking STD or a disease. Like, fuck no. One thing I don't play about is my health. Period. I'm not. Uh uh-uh. I don't care. That shit was three years ago, y'all. And we back on this because a bitch got in her feelings. Like, no. It's so annoying. It's so irritating. It's just like, grow up. Everybody needs to grow up. Leave the drama alone at this point. Like, fuck no. The the amount of people DMing me and messaging me about <laughs> my life and my health is just like, uh-uh, I can't take it no more. Stop. Stop. Don't have no type of... But yeah, I don't know why my phone keep doing this. The internet is just a toxic place. Um, I do real good ignoring them, but it's just certain things I cannot ignore. Like, seriously. So, yeah, like, mm-mm. And I, I don't know I never do stuff like this, like, ever. So, I'm very much triggered. Very much triggered, like. Um, I have a booking tomorrow, so I have loyal on Sunday. I cannot wait. I miss my baby so much. I got, um two weeks off I had a two-week vacation my mom and my grandma gave me a two-week vacation so I'm really excited about that but it's coming to an end I didn't start shit let me just tell y'all I didn't start shit I tweeted what the fuck I tweeted first of all I'm always telling people to boss up it might have been wrong timing but all I said was boss up period if y'all feel some type of way about my um tweet y'all thought like I'm not playing victim I stand on everything I'm saying it's still boss up like boss up you wouldn't be in the situation you in boss the fuck up if the shoe fit, wear it. Like, that's what I said. I'm not throwing rocks or hi- and hiding shit. Like, but y'all don't know the stuff that go on behind closed doors. Like, stop. Stop. And I'm not even here to air nobody shit out. But, like, I tweeted with the... F- I said what I said. I said what I said. Period. I don't care. I would never get on the internet and say, oh, my God, somebody didn't do this. Like, no, I'm going to do it myself. Mm-mm. Okay, but anyways, let's talk about something else. Anyways, I'm about to film a YouTube video, y'all. And um, I'm really excited because, yeah, I had braces. Um, yeah. I just don't want y'all to be on here being toxic because, like, this is all entertainment. And what people fail to realize is the internet is strictly entertainment for for you guys. Y'all, my manager, everybody is calling me because they are so mad that I'm on live right now. But like I was saying, this is entertainment. The internet is entertainment for for everyone. Like... The stuff that go on behind closed doors is the stuff y'all will never even see. So y'all only going off of what y'all may see or read. And it's just like, that stuff is all cap. Like, <laughs> it's just all cap. But at the end of the day, I get it. I get why y'all are so tuned in. Um, I get everything. It's just like, this shit just be, it's too much. Like, ugh. Quarantine got the internet. Every well, quarantine got people just cutting up. It's so annoying, and I'm annoyed, like for real. I'm so annoyed. Yeah, it's the skin for me. I thought you were supposed to be coming over to help me clean my <laughs> clean my closet.
I really do like hate the internet though, honestly. It's really, it's really like just negative. It really is. But I love y'all. The people who do support me, for real, for real, I love y'all. That's the only reason, I swear to God, I do what I do. Y'all are so messy. Uh-uh. Like, it's been going on too long. Like, shit is just annoying. Okay, but I love you guys so much. And um, I am about to get my life together and uh, film a YouTube video and eat some dinner. So, yeah. Love you guys so much. And I will talk to y'all probably later. I don't know. But, yeah.